Routinely, we run two, three batches every day, and you notice that the lab has been really working 24-7, particularly over the last five days after Hurricane Nana, to try to catch up and clear up all the samples. We um, have one set of sa samples that have come out for today. Um, I believe that that's the only samples that will come up because I think most of the, those they have caught up with. Um, doesn't mean that other district samples have been processed, but um, we only have um, 86 samples that have come out in the first batch for today, um, and four positive cases from that batch. And they all seem to be from the Belize district. I will not have the specific because those are just coming out now. I do know that we are following um, a construction site in Belize City that um, had symptomatic cases that may have workers from across the country. Um, a construction site also in the Cayo district, um, a construction site in Key Carper. Um, so we're trying to piece all of those together to find out linkages. And then just like we did when we had the situation in San Pedro, once we establish those, make a call to the community for you know anybody who may have been here, uh, this is what needs to happen. So all of that is being pieced together. Uh, particularly for NGO, as I said, a team is there from from Monday, um, help out, helping out the NGO team to see how we move from here.